business after one of its owners was involved in a deadly crash. What we've learned from the late night hearing. Governor Gina Raimondo will once again make her push for IGT to stay in Rhode Island. We'll explain both sides of this deal. What'd you say? I don't, I don't think we heard you. <laughs> maybe we don't want to hear. She has good news coming up. Maybe the point. we don't want to hear what she has no, to say. No, I, I think it's okay today. No, today is nice, <laughs> and then after that, uh, things are going downhill. Uh, after today is going to be like above average, mm -hmm. and then we're going to do that time to fall and blah 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 blah. Yeah, we'll but, figure it out because so that's what we do. Just a little behind the scenes stuff. I always make fun of Allison because she had a little space heater <laughs> underneath the desk. It's true. I'm like, what are you doing? So I broke down and now I have one on my side Prove because it. is it can you pull I don't know if you can pull it out. It is freezing in here. It is freezing. Here we go. One mm -hmm. and two. I can't lift my one and two, but we're safe. We promise we turn there it off go. after the show. But doesn't feel good. Yeah, so I'm gonna See? we're gonna need I'm gonna need this especially at the end of the week, huh, Christina? Yeah, that's for sure. Today temperatures will be in the 70s. By the end of it, just the 50s. So fall really here to stay. But this morning we are tracking a couple scattered showers. So let's get right to that satellite and radio.